Hey guys, what's up? This is HackApp1. Today I have a really cool Cydia tweak for you guys. And this tweak here is this application which will allow your iPod Touch, iPhone or iPad to boot Android system or Windows system free. So as you guys can see, you're going to need a jailbreak and iPod for this. If you don't have one, just check out my videos over there. It's well upside down there and you guys can do it easily free. And steps, go, I did whatever. So. As you guys can see, this application is called OS Faker, and it is free, and you can only get it from the Cydia, uh, from Cydia, yeah, from the Cydia application. So it is for only jailbreaking users, which is a down, but it is free, so yay! So once you download this application, you have to go into your Springboard and find it. And the funny thing is that it isn't called OS Faker, but it is called Loader, which is quite unusual, but it is still perfectly fine. So once you've clicked it, oops, let me just quickly go out, I can't show you this, it's because otherwise it will kill all of the cool parts. So, okay, we're back. Okay, so once you go onto this, you'll have these two icons here. So you have the option to either load, load Android or load your Windows. So let's first start with Android. You click it, you click load Android, yes, and you just wait for it to load. So cool. And so the cool thing about this process is that it doesn't take too long. As you guys can see, it's already halfway through. And it isn't temporary, which is sort of a downer, but it is cool if you guys want to try it out. So once you get there, you will get the whole Android system. As you can see, the battery is different. Everything is different, which is very cool. As well as you have Facebook, YouTube, contacts, and everything there all preloaded into the Android system. You also do have the Android browser, which is very cool. So it is your Android, proper Android browser. So it is like as if you're on the complete Android system. And so you also have Gmail. And the cool thing is you have your applications like this. But you don't have your actual applications that you had, but you have extra ones like paint, photos, etc. And Twitter. So if you guys want to next change application, you press the green button over here and you click shut down which won't shut down your iPod or your iDevice, but it will just take you out of this application. Now we can have a look at the um, Windows one. So just click it again, press OK, and yes. So again, as you can see, it doesn't take too long to load. It doesn't take too low to long, which is another yay, but it isn't temporary, which is another down. So this application, as you guys can most likely figure out for yourself, it isn't temporary, just to have a look and see what it is. So as you guys can see, your iPhone is, or iPod Touch in this case is completely changed and is now fully on the um, Windows 7 system. You have your people, internet, mail, text, pictures, Xbox Live and settings. Everything is in the complete hot uh, Windows 7 system format, which is pretty cool. And if you go over here, you can only see that it has two slides. If you go to the next one, takes a bit long like it's can you all have is calendar facebook and notes and if you go back you have this again so that's pretty much it and again to get out of this you can either press the home button but to be on the safe side you just go here you press power off you click yes and you wait for it to go out and that's it for this application guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did please thumbs up it'll be very cool as well as like down there favorite the video check out uh, leave any comments questions suggestions down below and as well as check out my website in the description and feel free to subscribe up top if you guys want to get the latest news on my videos or not hope you guys had a great day